Hey, hope you're having a good day. This Enoch coming back with another video. Took a couple days off. But yeah, I'm back. So, let's talk about why you wake up at certain times like you do spiritually. Why some people are actually choosing to not wake up. And why some people are not waking up. Now, why people are not waking up is because this system that we live in, society that we live in, known as The Matrix. If you haven't seen the movie The Matrix, go watch it. Look at it. All the shit that's going on in that movie is taking place right now. So, even when we were growing up as a kid, we were constantly being lied to all the time. Even when you was born, from that minute, your parents signed over your rights. That's why you have a slave badge. What is the slave badge? Social security number. But when you was growing up in school, you was lied to with history, with the grades. They wanted to make you so lost that they wanted you to think that you needed to be better than the next person when you were actually complete as a person. And they know that a child's soul is pure and they are innocent. So they try to manipulate your mind as soon as you come into this world. So with the history, his story, a fucking lie, they lied to you about everything. With church, they got you worshiping Satan, which is the God in your Bible is really Satan. So I believe in God. I know who God is, but I'm here to wake you the fuck up to the truth, to lead you to the afterlife, actually. But with everything, even with the, the TV, they lie to you on the television. They feed you certain lifestyles. So you would think that it's okay to go out and cheat on your woman or man. Even with the kids, they show kids these cartoons that will make them grow up faster than what they grow up. What will make a little girl turn into a hoe? What will make a little boy turn into a hoe, a pimp, all those things. He will be materialistic. He will think that he need all the materialistic shit in the world to be equal with everyone else. When the truth is, you just need to go back and connect with yourselves, man. Get rid of all that bullshit that's holding you back. All the machines, the technologies, all that stuff that's keeping you working at a low level. Go back into nature so you can actually find out who you are. But with that being said, some people are not choosing to wake up because they already know what's going on. Some people do not want to go into higher dimensions. Some people are actually satisfied with this matrix, believe it or not. They want to keep eating the shitty meat, the bad energy. They want to keep drinking that poisonous water. They want to keep being fed lies constantly so they don't give a fuck about waking up. So what's happening is people are actually separating. And we are not actually people. We are different alien groups. So some are choosing to stay in the third dimension which will become their hell. And some people are waking up, going to the fifth dimension and going up into heaven. So now you get what I'm saying. I'm trying to wake you the fuck up. So some people don't want to wake up, even though they know the truth. They saw they saw probably and they want to live for shit that doesn't really exist. Because at the end of the day, all this shit is an illusion and a test. You have to prepare prepare yourself for the afterlife and what's to come you have to gain certain knowledge so you do not have to come back here so if you don't know certain type of knowledge you will keep 
being reincarnated over and over. You may have been brought here, back here thousands of years. And I'm here now to wake you the fuck up and to help you ascend up to heaven if that's where you want to go. But you have to want to be able to go up there and not stay here because it's going to get worse and worse and worse. They show you this shit with the movies that you watch all the time. They putting this shit in your face. Everything that is about to take place. They putting it in your face. Truth hidden in plain sight. So. With other people that are actually choosing to wake up. Or what's really going on is that your DNA is unlocking. Now your DNA is unlocking because you are the chosen bloodline. You have a higher self. You have a creator at the top, your ancestors, spiritual gods, your real family that is up there and that is trying to get your attention so they can lead you to home. So certain situations you go through will help you unlock who you really are. So even with gang stalking, if you got set the fuck up and you lost everything, you lost your job, your house, your car. They sent you to a mental institution. Uh, you got incarcerated, went to jail or prison. This may actually help you unlock who you really are. Certain people do not wake up at certain times because you have to be, be at a certain point in your life. If you are not on the right path in your life, when somebody try to wake you up or when you actually wake up and find out who you are, you are going to freak the fuck out. So that is why... You are supposed to be at a certain point in your life when you choose to wake up, when your DNA actually unlocks and you can use 100 percent of your brain and you are not walking around sleep. You know, so I'm just here to wake you the fuck up and to lead you to where you are supposed to be. But you are choosing to wake up and it's in your DNA even before you got here. You signed a deal with the creator and you chose your family. Even though your family is fucked up, you chose your family and you knew what was going to happen. But when you got here, you lost your memory. Even with death, when you die, you forget what is going on in this lifetime. And this lifetime actually seems like it was a dream. But death and life is a process. That's all that it is, you know, so don't think it's death as, oh, somebody finna kill me, I'm so scared, and stuff like that. That's not what's going on. What's going on is when you die, you fucking graduate. When we are alive now and we are walking in these vessels, people don't know we are fucking dead. You feel me? I'm not trying to scare nobody or anything, but why do they, they say good morning? Morning of the dead. When people die, you are mourning, you are fucking crying. Your job, when you work, you earn a living. Ashes, cremated, wake the fuck up. The week, weekdays, you are in a fucking daze, asleep. Weekends, you are tired. Week in, you are too tired to go and look for the truth, information that is going to wake you the fuck up and help you see what's really going on. So that's why they got this system set up for you so you never find out who the fuck you is and you come back to this hellhole and you just, it's energy that is harvested and you are a fucking battery and all they want to do is drain your juice to the point where you can't recharge and you just fucking lost. But with that being said, man, some people are chosen to wake up at a certain time. It's in you. Some people choose to not wake up at a certain time. They ignore the signs, the creator and the spiritual gods. And some people actually want to stay here and go to hell. Peace. This Enoch.